Marjorie. Yes. Anyway. Could be bad. Ever vigilant. You sure you know where you're going? Cotter? Let's see that map again. So you're asking now, are you? Surprised you haven't taken it from my pocket already. How much food we got left? Here we are. Carried. How's the food? Well, this won't last much longer. If Finn wasn't eating all of it. It's not me. Why aren't there matter? We'll have to stop oh, soon. Look for some food. We're on the right track. This way. There's a bear ahead. Oh, that's whirling. The free folk. Oh, this. Oh, this complicates things. You stay here. I'll try and talk to her. I'm one of them. What? what? He's a fucking wildling, Cotter! They might kick me around a little, but whatever you do, don't come out, all right? She has to think I'm alone. If she sees you, you'll only make things worse. Okay. Good on, Ting. No, I'm, uh, I'm a friend. I grew up near Ardholm. You know it? I won't hurt you. All right. You won't. I'm one of you. I'm... Oh! oh. You sure look like a crow oh, to I'm me. Not. You're dressed like one. You out here all alone, little pup. Come out or I'll kill your friend! Or I'll make you scream first! He'll be all right, won't he? Ah! Ah! Oh! Stop! Please! You don't like it? You best hope your little crow brothers come looking for you soon. There's a lot more of them. Oh, Kill them! Nope, no you don't. Our food! Hey! Garrett! Garrett, no! She's not fighting yet! It's over! Just don't do it! Garrett, let her go!
She's dished all our food. Are those the last of our supplies. I probably should have killed him. We can't stay here. You're hurt. Come on. We can rest up ahead. Should have taken the bow and arrow just to have an extra like. No? It would make sense to me. I'd feel better seeing Griff dragged out of the Great Hall like that. What do you think? You wanted to kill him, didn't you? Oh. How did you know when to stop? I don't think I could have. I suppose that's why you're the Lord. I just knew it wasn't right. I wasn't the Lord I wanted to be. Yeah. What do you think Lord Whitehill will do when he hears? If he truly has a spy, he won't know of this. Not until we want him to. The gates are barred and every raven in the rookery is dead. There's still a traitor in the council, though. My lord, there's been a message from High Point. Lord Whitehill invites you to discuss a truce. He wants to make peace. As if we're that naive. I have knowledge. Maybe this is an opportunity. A way to get behind their walls. And do what? You'd be putting yourself in danger, Roderick. We could get Ryan back. This could be our chance. You're right. Now that we have Griff, we can propose a trade. A trade? His son for my brother. Then we have a plan. We'll leave first thing tomorrow morning. If you're going ahead with this, at least bring the Glenmore soldiers. We obviously need them here. You can't mean for Roderick to travel unprotected. What if the White Hills attack Ironrath while he's gone? My lord, you cannot go into an enemy stronghold unprotected. Nor can you leave Ironrath vulnerable. We have small folk soldiers. We'll need the Glenmores at High Point. They'll accompany us. Yes, my lord. Let Arthur Glenmore know at once. I'll start making the preparations. To think that one of them might be spying for the White Hills. Duncan wanted you to travel to High Point without any protection. Yet Royland would leave Ironrath defenseless. Well, we'll need an advisor with me at High Point. By rights, it should be your sentinel. But if we're going to an enemy stronghold, maybe you'd best take Sir Royland. It's meant to be a negotiation, not a battle. How could any of them betray us? I've known these people my whole life. Duncan's my sentinel. He comes to High Point. Yeah. Royland can stay here and defend Ironrath. Very well. I might have just fucked up and made the wrong decision. Roderick, I know I can't come to High Point. But I can't just sit around and do nothing. I want to help. Please. I'll do anything you ask of me. Talia, I may be leaving you here with a traitor. Find out who it is. Find proof if you can. I'll... I'll do my best. I have faith in you, Talia. I've known Lud Whitehill a long time. He's selfish, greedy, and arrogant. Mm -hmm. But he'd no, never no, no, no. kill a guest in his own home. Yeah. At least, I don't think he would. I hope you're right, Mother. He's locked up. Good riddance. Welcome. Don't worry about me. Focus on the mission. Your family needs you. That's what matters right now. 
You're my family too, Malcolm. And I couldn't be prouder of you. Thanks. Now it's best guys, eh? Good luck, my boy. So now we're going breaking into the city. Shall we begin? Listen up! There are four of these guard posts throughout the city. They'll use them to warn the masters in case the slaves decide they're tired of wearing chains. We're here to make sure they don't see it coming. Therund, you take the north. Penn, the south. Asher, we'll take the east. Ooh. And Kirin will cover the west. Make the enemy blind. Give the Unsullied a chance to get in and arm the slaves. The rest is up to them. Don't get cocky out there. One mistake, and the man you remember when we stole that giant war hammer? Get in, do what you have to do, and get your people Didn't she hit you in the face with it? That's all you I need never to thought my about. head could feel any You worse. got that. Tonight, any man who wishes to be free may take that freedom from the grip of his master. You will clear a path for them, but they must walk it alone. Justice belongs to the people of Marine. Do not make them wait any longer. Okay. What does she know of justice? Is there a problem? If you can't do this, tell me now. The Masters will be judged by the people of Marine, not by you. No problem here. As long as we get the reward you promised. You will have it. You will both do as Croft commands. Follow his orders exactly, or you will get nothing. Now go. Okay. Show them the hell they have made here. Yeah, she was a real bitch back then. She improved a small bit. Still a cool character though. Very cool. I hoped I'd never see this place again. Tried to run once. Didn't make it very far. Yeah, you made it far enough, don't you? So we have to take out the tower, is it? Which way? There's a path around there. Voids the main street. Let's just get this over with. Okay. Can you go this way? What's the matter, Croft? You see how many guards are out there? How were you expecting to get past them? We'll be caught. You asked me which way. This is it. Then we'll stay out of sight. Follow me. see anyone cover me <coughs> there's where to tie people up blood
Someone's up there. Then we'd better move. Uh -oh. What are they doing? Hey, Pesca! Pesca! Yo, Amisha. My is the wash. Shall she? Shall she do wash? Skuda juntas wa. Yelwa Misha, my is the wash. Shall she do wash? Spalsa washka. A my is the wash. Don't worry, we'll have her revenge. We have to go. There's something I have to do. Vesca, what are you doing? Do you trust me, Asha? We don't have time for this. Just tell me. Do you trust me? Of course I trust you. Good. This won't take long. Vesca! Where are you going? Follow her! He's going to kill the master. Oh no! Jailal, you have to be in! We're helpful! We're helpful! Ingi Dratuli! Se was was li wang yi gas! Why are you doing this? Ten years ago! Beska! Stop! I should have killed you! Beska! I should have fucking killed you! Beska! He was my master. Dezor Zoraza. Just kill him, man. The man Beska. who forced me to. Nobody can blame you for wanting him dead. Do what you must. I will. Have you lost your mind? I'm ordering you to back away! My... my best guy. I am not your... Get him, go! What are you doing? I shoot. You will do as I say! Both of you, take her weapon. I need to do this, Asha. After everything he's done. And he'll pay for it. Once the city is free, he will be punished. Punished by a queen who has no right to. His life means nothing to her. She does not speak for the children who died in those pits. Asha, stop her! I will get their justice. I won't let you ruin this for me. You heard what Daenerys said. There. How could... That wasn't your blood to take. Do you have any idea what you've done? The Mother of Dragons will have your head for that! Not before we finish the job. Now let's go. They're gonna discover that body now. You're gonna tell me he's a fucking Wavi. Not now, Finn. What is this? Come on. What the hell is this place? An old haunting camp. We can rest here. Until your friends attack us again. I know the signs, alright? It's abandoned. 
I think it's a white one. It's probably a new bag. Ah! I'm gonna go make sure nobody's lurking around out here. Don't okay. trust this fucking place. Fine. Here. Let me take a look at it. How? Oh, Just relax, will ya? What is that stuff? Ugh, oh, it smells like sick cow. The maester at House Forester used it on my leg once. I'm not sure what it is, actually. Do you even know what you're doing? Oh, hold that there. You almost done. so tight it does if you don't want to bleed to death yeah yes maester oh oh you got anything to drink this far north and i still have to fetch the fucking wine some water or something please i'll see what i can find Anything inside? Any water? Whoever was living here must have left. Too bad they didn't leave anything behind. This was a smaller hut. It's a bear. Well, I've seen this before. Don't move. I'm warning you. Oh, I'll... I'll gut you like a fucking fish. <laughs> you do look like a sad little fish, don't you? That happened a lot. I can fix it for you. But my friend is hurt. We're just looking for a place to rest. There are others with you. Step back! Want to kill her yourself, or should I do it? Garrett! Drop your weapon! Is that... Just let us go. We'll leave. That's what you want, isn't it? Cotter! Oh, Sylvie. You're alive! Who's this fucking snowball? I told you, come back. Who are these people? They're friends. You planning on introducing us, Cotter? Right. Uh huh. This is my sister, Sylvie. She's, She's the reason I brought you here. She can take us to the North Grove. Cool. You gonna take us though, Sylvie? Oh, it's high point. We're actually going. Lord Roderick. Lady Alyssa. Gwyn? And... Arthur Glenmore. I don't recall you being invited. Yet here I am. Roderick, may I have a word? Who? Oh. What were you thinking? Bringing those soldiers here is sure to set my father off. As if he needs more excuses. The Glenmores have sided with us. I want him to know it. I need you to cooperate today, Roderick. Why would I do that? I wanted us to work together, but you refused. So now my father is doing this his way. Who? If you value your life and your family, you'll listen to what he has to say. You need to take him seriously today, which means keeping a level head. I'm here in good faith, aren't I? That doesn't look like good faith to me. You have an impressive stronghold, Lady Gwyn. These walls hold a thousand years of White Hill history. 
thousand years of bloodshed. But our houses were close once, and could be again. So much of our history has been lost. Yep. Shall we get on with it? The Great Hall is this way. Are your soldiers expecting trouble? They're ready for anything. The way they see it, the enemy is within their walls. What's this? My lady? Give us a moment. Is this your family? Shortly before Griff was born. Are these your brothers? The eldest three, yes. Carl died of grayscale a few years ago. Ebbett's at the Citadel. Ooh. Torin serves Roose Bolton. And Griff, of course, wasn't born yet. Your father doesn't smile much, does he? He used to, when my mother was still alive. I see. Is that your mother? Yes. Though I hardly remember her. She died not long after this was made. That must be you. A <laughs> much younger me. Yes. You look Fair a bit enough. like your mother now. My brothers were never kind to Griff. He was boastful, gullible, and quick to anger. But my father always defended him. A white hill is a white hill, he'd say. Hopefully he defends him now. Come on. We mustn't keep my father waiting. Oh, I'll keep him waiting as long as I like. That painting's gonna burn. Where's your father? Strange. I'll go find him. I don't like this. Let's be ready to defend ourselves. Form up. Ryan for Griff. That is the plan. I'll look around. See what we're up against. If this goes badly, what do you want us to do? Fight to the death, Arthur. And make sure Lord dies first. Let's hope it doesn't come to that. But if it does, move to the walls and get behind my men. What's Lord Whitehill planning? He said he wanted a truce. And I believed it. I hope I wasn't a fool. Just follow know. my lead and we'll be fine. Mother, look at this. It's this iron looks crack. I'm not surprised. The White Hills were never any good at the craft. Oi! Step away from that! from the other side.
Welcome to High Point. Lord. You're not nervous, are you? You kept us waiting, Lord. What can I say? I lost track of time. I'm right. You had these Glenmore soldiers to keep you company. Father, please. Can we just get on with this? Well? Father once called High Point a keep for the gods. What stonework, he said. What craftsmanship. I don't trust He wouldn't point. stop talking about it. <laughs> if you ask me, I'd say he was envious. High Point is very impressive. It is, compared to your pile of timber. Lord, where's Ryan? Always worried about your family, aren't you? Let's toast. To family! Won't you toast with me, Roderick? As a symbol of our goodwill. Enough stalling, White. <sighs> no fucking courtesy. The iron business is thriving, Roderick. In fact, the Boltons want weapons faster than we can make them. And when Roos Bolton wants something, I like to give it to him. So, in other words, you need our help. <laughs> Don't be so damn full of yourself. You foresters are headed for destruction. Yet, you know more about Ironwood than any house in the realm. Would be a shame for all that knowledge to be lost. It would. Help me craft ironwood for the Boltons, and I'll make sure you foresters survive. That's absurd. If you think you can threaten I'm us... I'm not threatening. We help you, you don't kill us. Is that it? Roderick, this could save your house. She's right. I'm throwing you a rope. And asking us to tie it around our necks. You see what I have to put up with? Just give him time. I told you... I offer you peace. And you spit at it. I offer you opportunity. And you call it extortion? Yeah. I've seen this coming since you refused to kiss my ring. Here's how it's gonna go, Roderick. Either you agree to my terms, or I'll have Griff tear Iron Wrath to the ground. He'll put it to the torch. This isn't the way to Let get what you want. Let me slaughtering your small folk. Funny you should mention Griff. Have you heard from him, Lee? What are you getting at? He's locked in our darkest cellar along with your entire fucking garrison. You didn't. You've imprisoned my son. He was there by order of the Warden of the North. Now it's my turn to propose a deal. Your son Griff, for my brother Ryan. We want Ryan back, and we want him today. Bring the boy! Ryan! Mother! Frotric! I... I thought you'd forgotten about me. <laughs> no! Father, no! What are you doing? You imprisoned my flesh and blood. Mine! Let him go! He's not going anywhere! Listen to her! Let him go! Or I'll have Griff This killed. is not what we agreed. Blame him! Not me! If you want to see Griff alive again... Do you think I give two shits about Griff? About my fucking fourthborn? I want! I want to kill you right now! Because you forest has never learned. I'm not afraid of you! Just say the word! Kill me! And we all die! Let you go! Go, let me. Me. go on then! Do it! What? You think I want? I know you want! Don't test him, Roderick! Because for all your bluster, all your posturing, you care about your son. 
Whitetail is still a Whitetail. You know what, Roderick? You're right. Uh. <coughs> Ryan, come here. No. We'll make the trade on neutral soil. Griff yes. for Ryan. A son for a son. He's my brother, though. Fine. Now, get the fuck out of my hall. And the gods have mercy on us both. When the Boltons come for their ironwood. It's been a pleasure, Lord. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Roderick. Iron from ice! Teleported. There it is. The East Watcher. Now listen up. None of those guards can live long enough to light that beacon. Because if they do, this invasion gets a whole lot fucking harder. Don't drop that. There's two we need entering. to take those two out first. How many men do you think are in there? Hard to know for sure. At least five, maybe more. To answer your question, too many to fight head on. We can bar the door. So we do this quietly. Unless you want 50 crossbow bolts in your chest. Is that a harpy? Of course it is. Those golden tits are everywhere in this bloody city. If those guards light the rope, the fire travels up to the bowl, and the whole city will know we're here. So we stop them. Aye. Come on, let's get moving. Okay. Beska. Hmm? It's nothing. Just forget it. Focus. We have to move. This mission won't wait for us. That's all you care about. Oh, she's pissed off at me. Ah, can't blame her really, though. I'll take him. I've got the other one. Just keep an eye on her. I don't need him to watch me. Then prove it! What have you heard? Just sit outside the gates waiting. Pfft. Mother of dragons. She wants to scare us, but she won't do it. Not unless she's a fool. We'll split up. One group will go high and try to climb over to the other side. What about them? That's why someone needs to stay down here. They get behind cover and shoot the men up top. Just don't let that one see you. So, which will it be? We'll go over the top. You just make sure you clear the way. We're clearing them out, not too bad.
hear that? This Khaleesi calls herself the breaker of chains. I think Croft got the easy job. Did you trust him to do it? on the roof. We'll take care of it. I'll get rid of them. I've got it. Go! That guy's gonna see us. Gotta make sure he can't scream or anything. They're still up there. On the right. Take them out, and you'll be clear to secure the beacon. They break through. I'll keep them busy. Okay. We can finish this. Just look at them. Two men. We've dealt with worse. Let's rush them and be done with it. What about them? You afraid of a couple of crossbows? We took on the Lost Legion by ourselves. We stick to Croft's plan. Take care of them first. All right. It's better to be safe than sorry. Thinking that is no beacon to light. <laughs> oh, I can't 
believe you did it. Croft! Croft! Quit your whimpering. I'm not dead yet. Good, good. You hear that? It's starting. Now can we light it? Come here. Last. Back at High Point, I wasn't sure your brother would survive the day. He nearly didn't. I was terrified when you called Lud's bluff, but you knew exactly what you were doing. Of course, did. And now Ryan will be coming home. He'll sleep in his bed, eat at our table. We'll celebrate once Ryan has returned safely. We still need to make the trade. Yes. You're right, of course. Still. You did well today. Don't lose sight of that. Thanks. My lord, look! Where are the gods? This isn't good. Dahlia! Sir Ryland! Where's my sister? Elena! Where's anybody? <laughs> Wait here. Uh oh. Sir Ryland's traitor. <laughs> Come on. Don't be so dreary. It was a joke. I'm sorry, I. I should have laughed. Oh, maybe you think you can do better. Of course not. I I didn't mean to ever. Perhaps a song instead. I hear you've written a touching song about your dead brother. Am I in it? Let's hear it, shall we? No. No. Roderick. Roderick. Welcome back. State your business now. I thought you'd have more courtesy. Especially after getting to know your sister. We've had a lovely time together. Haven't we, Talia? Say it. Say it's been lovely. It's been lovely. And you. I'm told you're a man who can't be broken. I've decided to come see for myself. Uh oh. Not good. Ethan was the first forester I killed. Doesn't have to be the last. You don't know what you're in for, Garrett. What you're asking my brother to do. The North Grove isn't what you think it is. You claim to be a leader, yet your own people do not respect you. But we did as you commanded. These aren't cell swords, Asher. They're killers. Roderick! I can't believe I trusted him. I know you and my brother were in contact. Perhaps he told you things. Things that might prove his guilt. Perhaps you're not to be trusted either. Oh, you're not listening, Garrid. Shh. I did it. Glamour soldiers probably would have died. Anyways, uh, that's enough for now. Hopefully, do some more tomorrow, and uh, we'll see you next time.